welcome to my channel, it's Miss Kitty Chaos, some adventures of a riot girl and today I'm going to do a bit of a, what I had for my birthday plus kind of I've been doing the monthly haul so what I got in March I didn't really buy a lot or get sent a lot so I thought I'd just put them together um, again just a disclaimer this isn't any kind of bragging video just people have asked like what I got for my birthday and sometimes this is just the easier way to show them plus I'm quite nosy and I love watching these sort of videos so Okay, let's start with, I'm just going to, the way I usually do these is just randomly grab something. So, I'll start with what my mum got me, or well, I'll just show you what I got in general. So, I've already worn these, and I forgot what a killer that um, Converse are to break in, but I got some Wonder Woman Converse. These are really cool, I really like them, but uh, I think I'm already giving myself blisters with them, so I need to relace them and break them in a bit but these are really cool so I had these off my mom and I really like them I thought they were ace and then uh, oh I had some Maltesers but they got eaten um she also made me like a big chocolate cake um if you follow me on like Instagram you probably saw it or Snapchat or something um yeah and just that was really nice um, kind of cat eyed sunglasses which are just from Primark, but they're really nice. I thought these were really cool, and they come with the little pouch. And these are great because it's starting to get sunny. Because I just I, there's no point in me buying expensive sunglasses because I just end up breaking them. Also got some socks. I'm already wearing one pair, but um, this was a whole pack, and they have these really cute little French bulldogs on them. Because you know you can always trust your parents to get you some socks. And then I think from my brother I had some more socks and these ones have like a little pug on them. Oh, these are all pugs. <laughs> a little sailor pug and another little sailor pug. They're really cute. And again, these were from Primark, but like I said, socks are great. And then from, I think these were from my brother. <laughs> if you've been following me, you already know that I sort of collect piggy money banks. And I've got a little sort of teapot like this. So my brother got me this, um... One, I actually had one kind of really similar to him. He's called Wilbur Pig and I broke him. So I was really chuffed to get this. It's really cute. It's, um, I think he was made in the, he was made in the 50s or 60s. So that's quite cool. Then I had, oh, a big tub of lollipops. Some more sunglasses. My brother chose these ones for me pair of big pink these will be great I'll wear them like I said cheap sunglasses because I just break them oh wow some more socks I don't remember these ones um these ones have got like little cats on them yeah little cats they're cute and okay that's everything in that bag then I think my brother also got me a couple of candles because he knows that I like these candles from Primark. So he got me um, the Madagascan Vanilla, which smells really nice. And the pink grapefruit because I really like pink lemonade and stuff. I don't know, it's like grapefruit or raspberry or something. But these are always really good. They, they burn for quite a while and we like to have sort of candles burning around the house because it's relaxing and it's nice. Then I've got... Yeah, that's that's from my family my bestie got me a new look gift card and i'm gonna probably buy a handbag with this hopefully because i'm in desperate need of a new handbag and then who knows i might do a what's in my bag if you've seen a decent handbag let me know and then her parents who are always the kind they're like family for me got me this raspberry range from the body shop so this is the um body lotion and then they also got me, they wrapped it up with this lovely tissue paper, it's so lovely. Um, then they also got me the body scrub. Same flavour, these are all the same flavour. And then the um, body butter as well. So that was really sweet, I thought that was really kind and generous. And then one of my favourite gifts was from Neil and he got me this print. Which is, if you don't know who this is, then you're too young. But this is Ludo from The Labyrinth. But it's also super cool because it's one of 50. So, well, this is the fifth one out of 50. 
and it's also made by True Heart and Soul who if you remember Four Foot Fingers it's also like it's the lead singer from Four Foot Fingers but he's also the lead singer of Hook Line Riot they're a really cool punk band and they're really ace and we went to see um, Mass Intruder and Hook Line Riot on our anniversary last year so this is a really sweet gift I love this I'm gonna get a, a really nice frame for this and it's really nice and even says happy birthday Kelly on the bottom which is really cool so this is like probably my favourite out of all the gifts that I got. I mean, I love everything and I'm so grateful for everything I got, but this is probably my favourite. Then some hint that um, also from Neil's parents, I had like, we had money and we bought um, a bottle of Honey Jack Daniels and I also had a big thing of wine from my mum, but they're all gone. They're all gone. We enjoyed those though, it was nice. Then I got this gift come in the post from um it was such a surprise and it came bang on my birthday and it's from some fellow bloggers and um Georgina from She Might Be Loved She's so sweet and a couple of the blogging babes that I love and talk to all the time they sent me this little gift and it was so unexpected and I just wanted to literally cry because it was so kind and I couldn't believe it so I'm just going to quickly go through the things that were in there I had this really nice little makeup bag it's really cute it's got like little thing and so you can clip it into a handbag if you want to so you don't lose it and that's from LYDC London and I love that that's really sweet and it's something that I will use it can be like a makeup bag or a purse or whatever then I'm just going to drag these out randomly so then we've got this lovely sandalwood and vanilla intensive moisturizing enriching with argan oil dry body oil which is from these guys this is so nice it smells lovely as well i was literally like oh my god i can't believe how generous this is and they had these lovely um kiss look so natural um eyelashes in hot see that yeah i'm having to look to see what you can see i had these really cute um press on nails they're like there's like a gold glitter on a polka dot and a pink one they're really sweet can't wait to try those out also have some more eyelashes um in shy they're really cute and then another one i was like oh my god there's so many in flirty these ones are really these are really cute these are kind of the eyelashes that i would wear all the time i like my eyelashes big when i wear fake eyelashes i think if i have to go to all the hassle to put these fake eyelashes on they better be big and you know out there then oh this is like a range so i'm gonna get all of those out the lee stafford coco loco coconut balm this is for um straw to silk shiny happy hair and i'm always complaining that my hair is awful lately so this is perfect and it's like um sort of like that it's like a balm and then with that as well there's the coco loco um oil kind of thing so you can use these together and this is the protect and repair 24 hour cream from eq that's really nice as well so my hair might get back into tip top condition which will be nice and there's this gorgeous hand it to me dreamy hand cream in a blend of um lemon balm and it smells like lemony and rosy kind of it's really nice i love hand cream always got hand cream on me so that will get used as well then we have these lipsticks which are from Sleek. I was I was literally pulling everything out like I can't even believe it and I'll swatch these for you and add that in. So this one is Guest List. Night Spot. Backstage, private booth, and reserved. So <laughs> there was the um, Sienna body polish scrub and the Sienna um, radiance body balm. 
literally I'm gonna be able to spoil myself right on with these that's why I was so excited and a cucumber peel off face mask a little mirror from tweezer man always handy I'm always losing my mirror and then a Marc Jacobs Daisy perfume I love perfume so I was really excited dropped it <laughs> luckily I'm on a bed really excited to have this so I was just so overwhelmed by how generous it was so thank you so much Georgina and to the other ladies that helped to pick out things for me um I think that's all my presents and then there should be stuff that I haven't really bought a lot this month so I just thought um instead of doing another video I would just sort of add those things in so I've been sent to a review um by this lovely author Ian Avery who sent me the last laser show he contacted me on Goodreads and asked if I'd give this a read so I'm really excited to read this because um apparently he, he likes all the same authors that I do and he thinks that he can live up to that so you'll see a book review from this coming soon also I had a book called Beneath the Surface which a review is going up on my blog soon if I've already done it before I put this video up I'll put the link below but if not I'll come back and add it so if you're watching this at a later date you'll be able to see it also coming up I'm going to do an unboxing of this properly it's the Sleep um, S Plus by Resimed and it's like um, to help you track your sleep and improve your sleep and I'll do a proper unboxing to show what's inside this and um, how it works you have to like hook it up to an app or something then I got so, um, this blue sort of ebay lipstick so I really wanted to try it out to see what a blue looks like on me because I really want the Kat Von D blue but um, I don't want to pay out for it and then blue doesn't suit me so I thought I'd pay 99p for that one see how it works see if it looks nice and then if it does definitely get it then I had this little sample and I wanted to show this because it's so cute I think it was just I just ordered the sample on the website um, and it came like this like love your age and then you open it up it's from Lancome you open it up again and I chose to have the serum and the moisturizer but look how big these samples are I was so impressed I thought like a little sachet was going to come so it just shows you should keep an eye on like um, people's social media or websites or whatever because they often will give out samples like this so you can have a go and try it without splashing out loads of money i mean i have tried some lancome stuff before and i really liked it so um it's nice to be able to try that kind of stuff before i buy it and then i did have another lipstick oh here it is um I, you might remember from another haul i had a couple of these which are just an ebay one this is just a nude i actually really like this and again i'll show it swatched on the lips like i did for the others and i also got sent it's all wrapped up still i didn't want to undo it until i showed you it's wrapped up lovely in this paper i am a sucker for notebooks and a fellow blogger was has actually created this study notebook and um told her i'm just getting into bullet journaling so she she did it in like this kind of paper for me and I can use it like a bullet journal anyway because it's basically a big notebook with the little it's a little thing here and I'll show you how I am using this because I am going to because I want to try bullet journaling but I don't want to um, do like a big sort of thing with it and then I don't really like it and I don't want to invest in the proper bullet journal journals until I know that I'm going to enjoy it but it's the best way for me to see if I'm going to stick to planning and this is from the study notebook company and she's a lovely girl who sent me this it's really nice you can have it in like a mint green but i chose to have it in pink and i think that's it for this month like i said i haven't really bought much this month but uh, i was so like gifted gifted i can't think of the word so lucky to be fortunate to get all these gifts from people for my birthday and i was so overwhelmed and so excited and I think people have just been so generous and lovely. So thank you to everyone who gave to me for my birthday. And um, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, like and subscribe. And let me know what other videos you'd like to see from me. And make sure you go to the blog, which is always linked down below with all of my social media. Thank you. Bye.